I think mad women could also be a turn on for some of you. So guys, what is your biggest insecurity in the bedroom? So the first time I got to know that women can actually fake an orgasm like hit me really hard like was she faking it all the time? <laughs> <laughs> So my biggest insecurity would be if my partner gets uh, an erectile dysfunction. It makes me think, was it me? So I start doubting whether am I good enough or not. I think my biggest insecurity would be of the fact of how I'm looking and uh, how it should not be a turn off for my partner. It's so pretty similar to yours. I think uh, what faces I make in the bed. I think that's my biggest insecurity. <laughs> <laughs> Mine is like whether I was able to understand what the person is communicating me in the bed. So how do you deal with these feelings? I just cry in my bed. <laughs> <laughs> so I think to deal with this, I actually calm myself. So like I go in that introspective phase where I'm like it's okay to not be okay at times. I ensure that there is proper communication and I deal with the person that okay this is the boundaries this is the thing you want this is the expectation and this is what I can offer i think in my case what faces are making is not something i can control and the person is getting a lot more things so my face is not something they should be bothered <laughs>